Hello Skullgirls fans, this is Shadow Fury 63 after a bit of a hiatus. I got sick in December and then got busy, so yeah, I haven't really had the opportunity to do three streams a week, which basically meant the Skullgirls stream that I've been planning on doing was not being done. But I'm free now, or freer now I think, so let's see if I can get back to that schedule that I was planning on doing. Basically, essentially this is the training diary of a sort, although admittedly if someone wants to join in and do something where kind of talking to each other while playing. I'm quite happy to do that too, but right now it's just going to be me playing quick matches and discussing various things, mostly what's going on in front of me. Partly things that I had previously learned. Anyway, let's begin. So as usual, I maintain that I'm playing Fortune and Fu- oh, whoops. Oh, right, I'm playing BGL. Okay, yeah, in beta, Platon the drill, heavy drill for Fuku is not, no longer invincible, as I'm sure most people watching know. So that's not my assistant beta, but it's still in regular. So, me versus Quigley, a matchup I'm not really too fond of. Basically, as soon as Quigley gets a hit in, I'm kind of screwed. Thankfully, that hasn't happened so far. Damn it, that was supposed to be a DP. I was hoping for a DP there, but it didn't quite work as expected. Ah, I think we'll get the THC timing down. I usually try to DHC it on that last hit, but that didn't quite work out as I wanted it to. And that's where problem starts. Because this point Squiggly is going to get me into a 20 hit combo going into probably a throw reset. And I basically have to... Oh, it wasn't a throw reset. That was... different. Whoa! Okay, well... I just threw away that match. Ah, that's something. Okay, that's probably the thing that the only thing that annoys me input-wise this game. I don't know if it's me or well, it must be me. I probably check the footage, but it's always I always want to do crouching medium kick when I want to do standing medium kick. I don't know if it's that I'm not releasing crouch in time or what. I, I don't know what it is. I can never figure it out, but I did not want to do that at all. It's supposed to be kick, not down kick. Yeah, I don't know what it is that that causes. Like what I'm doing that's causing that to happen, but it's really annoying. Oh, this is getting embarrassing. Okay, this should be a kill on Squiggly. There we go. One down. Let's see if I can close that deal. And you were thinking that Fook would be my go to. No, never mind, I'm dead. I'm not dead? Okay, now I'm dead. Here I thought Fook would be if I needed to go one character or just drop a character, be maybe Fortune, but apparently not. Apparently my Fortune is actually better than I thought. This is surprising to me. I always thought my Fortune was terrible. Nope. 240 MS ping is way too much. One thing I have learned in the interim is that there are other air move options than instant air dash. Once again, another Guilty Gear habit. I should point out, I really do like Guilty Gear, it's just having that being my first fighting game that I really played before Skullgirls, which is the first fighting game I really played competitively, but that being the fighting game that I essentially learned fighting games on, I learned a lot of bad habits, like not blocking and always doing this in air dash and focusing far more on combos and fundamentals. Stuff like that. Of course, it's not going to come with Pain Wheel, just Peacock and Parasol. This is going to be painful. What? Okay, I don't know what is going on with the fiber jump... Fiber jump input stuff. Okay. That worked out well, too. I... Okay, maybe it won't be as painful as I expected. 
Ah, that was a hop. That was high. Okay, Fortune's dead. That's just pain. That's pain wheel for you. Fortune is dead. Best thing I could do right now would be to try to switch out to Fuqua and hope for the best. Nope. I'm screwed. So it sounds like this. I wish that was a forfeit option, like in RTS games, because I know I can't win this. I, there's no point wasting my time on this. I, I, I suck against Pain Wheel, and my my lead character is dead. And my other one is gonna be stuck in 50 hit combo before finally getting just wrecked completely. Yep, 59. I had no way out of that. There was no recent opportunity. And people say Pain Wheel is low tier. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, I... I still don't know what to do against Pain Wheel. Parasol and Peacock, I've learned a bit. I can jump. I can double jump. I can super jump. I don't have to instant air dash. But Peacock, I just don't... Oh, sorry, Pain Wheel, I just don't know. I have no idea what my options are. Like, what can be done. Let's put an end to this cat and mouse game. Oh, Parasol and, and Pain Wheel, perfect. Showtime! <laughs> Oh, I could have been down. Down was my hit confirm. Okay, I shouldn't have been heavy kick. I should have been a light kick. Okay, maybe I was wrong with Fortune. My Fortune is still terrible. I to get in. And not just like that. No, that's the one I wanted. Why am I not moving forward? I, sometimes I think my stick is broken. Seriously, I've been... There's just so many times where I'm trying to move and it's not moving. Nope. Oh, right. Oh, I was kidding. I can... Air dash with the double punch. Yeah, full disclosure, I've been playing the Steam version of Blaze Blue Continuum Shift because... Apparently that's what it takes for Exer to be on Steam, or for any other Arxis games to be on Steam, is for people to buy it. But it's actually pretty- it's better than I expected. It's just... messing up some of my muscle memory. Not a huge amount of it, just a bit. I'm air dashing the hard way, for example. As you might have noticed if you're watching the pad light. I am air dashing the hard way, that's... I keep forgetting I can double tap. Double tap, punch, air dash. You're under arrest. Come here. Ladies and gentlemen, Okay. I'm gonna try the physics with a start. Nope, that didn't work. I must say though, Skullgirls is a much better input buffer than that than Blaze Blue by far. It's just one of the things that's been frustrating about the game is the input buffer is terrible. What? Like, other than the I aforementioned thing about down, which I, I think is just my own muscle memory on stick. I mean, I have only been playing stick for like five months, so it's probably that. Everything seems to basically just work the way I want it to. I just don't know what to do. That's the only problem. A lot of the inputs are messing up. It's just I'm I'm messing up, but that's fine. I can I can work with that. I just knew what to do here. Why am I forgetting all Fuqua's specials? Although, admittedly, against Parasol, there really is no time, I find, to actually pull them off. Napalm shots just come off all the time. I don't want to be crouching again! I didn't want to be crouching. I want to be standing. It needs to be standing, Heavy Punch. That's the only... That's my combo. There we go. Finally, I get something done. Finally, I get a character out. 
Hey. That's the one thing about Fuqua is they do have projectiles to work with. Now my problem is I have to rely on them and that didn't work at all. And then we're back to Pain Wheel where I lose. Because I can't fight Pain Wheel. Save my life. Nope, if my life if it was a life or death if it was not a money match, but a life or death match, I would die. I would just pretty much have to commit suicide because there'd be no point even trying. I I cannot play against Pain Wheel. I don't know if it's the matchup or what. I just I don't know. I mentioned it last time too, and someone actually helpfully li listed a bunch of players, but I haven't bothered them yet about. I haven't bugged them. I, mean, I suppose I probably should bug them, but I haven't. Uh, someone else. Not... Not who I've been playing so far. Hopefully not another Pain Wheel player, although admittedly I need to learn Pain Wheel. I just... Someone needs to teach me how to... Like, someone needs to actually talk to me about how to beat Pain Wheel. I can't figure it out on my own, you apparently. Zarabelle, on the other hand, I have a bit more... I have a bit less trouble with. Why do I keep messing up? There we go. Yeah, see, I keep messing up the heavy punch thing. I didn't. That, that was easy. Okay. See what I mean? I have no. I have very little problem with Arabella. I forget about that launch note. Mostly because it's kind of been a mistake most of the time I've done it. Why are you keep doing heavy kicks there anyway? I'm trying to do fortune. Or trying to do Fuku heavy kicks with fortune. It's not working. <sighs> Man, my combos are not where they were before. <sighs> Why did I forgot the heavy kick? I forgot the heavy kick again. Right. I'm doing this because okay, when I'm if I'm doing kick, that's safe. The kick follow up is safe. The down kick follow up is not, but the down kick follow up is great on the confirm because it allows me to continue the combo. I dropped so many freaking combos. I mean, I won, but I didn't win well. So I think I'm, what, two for four right now? Not entirely sure. Valentine and Big Van. That was the assist start. Why do I block towards... Block the point character. Always block the point character. Okay, this... I'm dead. Hey, I got the follow up! What? Actually, that was a mistake. I did not mean to throw my head off. I never mean to throw my head off. Especially when Big Band's on the table. That's just... Going headless against Big Band is suicide. Uh, man, I can't believe I dropped that combo. I needed that combo in order to do something. Uh, is... I apologize for the lack of talking this while I'm doing this. It is rather difficult to concentrate. This player is a little above my level. No, I think I'm screwed. I might have a chance. No, if I if they drop if I get out of this on the reset, then I might have a chance. 
if I do everything perfectly after this after this point. Nope, no, I'm dead. I'm dead. So much for that. I don't know who even who Dementia is. But yeah, they won. Yay. I do kind of wish there was more in beta that I could reliably do quick matching there, because I, I do like the beta changes, and I want to be practicing with them for when the patch actually drops when Beowulf is complete. Unfortunately, there aren't a lot of people on there, and I couldn't get anyone let's in Skullheart. For, well, I didn't really ask anyone for a lobby playing Skullheart, so... Okay, Dementia again. Let's see if I can pull this off this time. Just gotta remember not to drop the combo. What? I thought it was blocking! Great, well, I threw it away. Admittedly, I had the same problem last time, and I was able to block the cross-up. What? How in the world did I get close enough for that to work? <sighs> cross-ups that I can't seem to get every time. <sighs> oh yeah, see, the thing about beta. This level is not available in random select in beta. What? That was down the forward. You reset. Okay, there is. Oh, come on! Can't believe I screwed that up. Okay, that's fine. Oh, well, except I can't get out. I tried to air dash. I can't air dash with Luke. Forget this at my own peril. What's I'm not dead yet? Now it's a switch out. Yep, there it is. Ah, that was down to back throw, not down to back punch, a stupid game. Or kick, rather. Throw. Why did I not get that? I think... I wonder if that's fixed in beta. I know there were some buffer changes in beta. That might have been one of them. I got closer that time. It's not good enough. I didn't win. Yes, I realize that my attitude really should be focusing on smaller things, but especially when I'm showing, when I'm streaming, I feel really bad for not winning or being streamed. It's like, it just feels embarrassing. Like I should be performing Can well, and I'm not. Beat him up, guys! Action! What? I'm oh, unfortunate dead. Cane Wheel exemplifies the Skullgirls meta of don't, well, more of the joke, of don't get hit. Mostly because you can't hit her back. Because of her freaking armor for, oh, that's not what I wanted. Oh, actually that was what I wanted. I was able to salvage that. See, I, armor frames in the move means it's basically impossible to even confirm when you do hit. There's gotta be something I'm missing about how she works, but I do not know what it is. I cannot figure it out. I've been playing her in training mode just to try to figure out what the heck I can do. What the heck she is. What is weak about her, but the only thing I find weak about her is the fact that her combos are really tricky to figure out if you don't know how they work. That's the only thing I found tricky about her. It's like, it's just figuring out how to chain, string more than two or three buttons together. The, the timings on the moves are awkward. That's about the... Crap. This is gonna go poorly. 
The timing and the moves are awkward. That's, that is about the only thing I've noticed that is weak about Pain Wheel. So if someone, if I'm playing someone who has their execution down, I don't know what her holes are. I suppose maybe I should actually try playing that online. But that would just go terribly. I don't even think I'd be able to figure out what her holes are that way, just because I don't know. That's the thing. Is like, I don't know her well enough to be able to work out what her holes are by playing her, since I haven't, I'm not good enough at playing her to even be, to even be the caliber of player that would find it useful, because my opponent is being able to counter what I'm doing. What I'm trying to do there is actually down to back, heavy punch into down to back medium kick, but I keep messing up the inputs on that. I do the down to back too soon. Because for whatever reason, my left hand and right hand do not like to cooperate. This is a common problem for me playing Fortune, is that my I'm inputting the directions way earlier than I am the button inputs. Crap. But yeah, the button inputs are coming in way... L there we go. Button inputs, I... I'm waiting until later. I mean, I'm hitting him at the right time, but I think the direction's too soon. I don't know. <laughs> my Corpus Colossum is there. It is working. The two sides of my brain are connected. It's just, for some reason, the... There isn't quite that level of motor connection, I guess. I don't know. Perhaps it really just is unfamiliarity with the stick. Granted, it's probably not a bad idea to learn Headless Fortune just so that when I do that and I screw up, I can work off that screw up, rather than having to just try to pick up my head and carry on. If I recall this one, I, I think I won against this person. I think they were the one I thought was easy. The Cere yeah, Cerebella and Valentine. Well, they're easy in that match. I don't think it's going to be easy this time. Of course, that would help if I actually... Uh, if I could ever do a standing medium kick. Ever in my life. Uh, what? What the... Uh, I don't know why he's screwing that up. I honestly don't know what it is about... What I'm doing, I keep screwing up that input. There's so many inputs I keep screwing up. Okay, well now I've just lost. Probably. I'm honestly not sure. Alright, that's still invincible. I should take advantage of that while I have it. I mean, I can't combo off it, but, you know, it's invincible. At least it's a reversal option. Oh, bad. Ah, I thought I had them. I don't know why I keep messing up those combos. They work, they work fine in training mode. I don't know why I'm dropping them now. Great. Well, so much for that. Apparently, I suck against this person, too. Great. And yes, I'm always this salty. Any video, fe any video featuring me not being this salty was an exception. I'm sorry if that breaks an illusion you may have of me, but yes, I am a miserable, rage-filled person. Okay, maybe that's actually not true, but yeah, I do get frustrated by my controls seemingly not... My hands and my brain are not working together right now, and I don't know why. And it always bugs me when that happens. I think it bugs most people when that happens, so I'm imagining most people will understand where I'm coming from here. Curiosity can't kill me. Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime. <laughs> Not amusing. Did that sting? Hold together. Tail and nails. Tail and nails. I don't know why that keeps missing. Seriously, that works all the time. I don't, that's that should connect. Heavy, heavy kick into 
Canceling Heavy Kick into Fiverr is supposed to work. I don't know why it's not working. What? That, see what I mean? It's like, it's, maybe just, I have to cancel it two hits so they change it. Unless something change in beta, because I do most of my practicing in... Crap. In beta, so it probably is what it is. Wanted. No place to run. Oh, that was... There we go. What the, how did that fail? How in the world did that fail? Uh, it's Zed and everything. There we go. Okay. Ah. Wow, I had five bars of super. I can't believe I, let, I I never let that happen. That is unusual. I try to use my super whenever I can. Oops. I'm always trying to use my super. It's actually one of my biggest weaknesses. Although there's one thing I have... Well, it was one of my biggest weaknesses in Guild Gear is always going for overdrive. If I had 50% or more tension, I'd always go for overdrives. I've learned since, more recently, mostly from watching excerpt footage, that Roman Cancel is actually useful. I did not realize this before. I don't know why. I think because I've been convinced that it was only useful for continuing combos if you know your combos down and you need RCs to continue them. But no, it's actually really useful just to make things safe. That otherwise wouldn't be. There we go. Wow, I, I'm sorry, Braven two three four. That. I guess we won. I just started hitting you, and then I couldn't stop, because that's well, it's the game. I mean, that that is the game in a nutshell. Is you you hit the other person, and you don't stop hitting them, until they start trying to hit you. That that's how it works. I'm sorry. Oh, no, I... That, yeah. Wow. Curiosity can't kill me. If you watch this, I might be able to give you some tips. But, yeah, let's Showtime. just go to the next one. Solo Bella! A dreaded matchup for many people. I'm not sure how this is going to work, though. I don't know why I'm keeping my head off. I really don't. I actually probably should have put it back on a while ago. Okay. Okay. I just thought I'd practice it because I seem to be doing pretty well, so it seemed like a good time to practice. Ah, I pushed block too soon. That was the problem. Wow. There we go. Taking advantage of the unsafe nature of the diamond dynamo. Whew. Block, push block, and then don't push block at the very end. And then hit them. There it works. Ooh, I wonder who this is. Probably someone in town, actually, the 56 ping. But apparently we shall never know, because it's waiting for join confirmation and may wait forever. Oh. Name's not familiar. They may not necessarily be in town. 56 milliseconds ping could be probably anywhere from Edmonton to Washington. 
the city. Oh well, no, sorry, Edmonton to Seattle. That in sort of a circle. Well, maybe Edmonton to Portland, one, I guess. Given the circle. Edmonton's pretty far away. That is one thing I'm noticing I'm not doing right. I'm not committing to my attacks as well as I could be. Especially the follow-ups that need buffering. Like that, there. Should have been... I should have done the fiber actual jump. I didn't. Wait, why am I in the corner? That's not right. Oops. Ow! Oh, I wanted to do the... I did not want to do that. I wanted to do the... The... What was it? I wanted to do the ball super. That one. That was the one I wanted to do. There we go. Not sure who Montium is, or Ford Apt. I guess they're... I don't know who that is, or Adapt, I suppose. But apparently they were close by. Okay, I think this is going to be my last one. I hope you guys have been enjoying this. I realize it's basically just been me rambling over me alternately winning and losing and getting really salty and occasionally getting explanatory and at one point getting slightly conciliatory. But for the most part, I have just been rambling. And not much about much in particular. I mean... No interesting sociopolitical discussion, although admittedly I don't believe this is the forum for that, but it would have been something. Sadly, I had nothing to say. Let's see. Or rather, no topics came up. Cameras rolling and oh, this is gonna be weird. Oh, I haven't seen the lives ever. All the all the DLC characters! That's what this is! It just occurs to me. How it didn't occur to me beforehand is beyond me. I think because I started playing when Squiggly was added, so for me, Squiggly is not a new character. I actually partly bought the game because Squiggly was in it, or rather because Lauren Lander voices Squiggly, and because I like her voice. She has a pretty voice. Well, I got enough for DHC at least, if I ever get the chance. What? Oh, I'm blocking low. Oh, well, for the want of a low block. All right, PBGC Super. Thank you, Mike, for adding that. <laughs> the green indicator. Actually, the beta has has Blaze Blue P four A style cross. Well, not so much cross up, but mix up indicators and counter hit indicators as well. Although it's only the mix up indicators that are Arxis style. Counter the throw. Good read. Ah, what? Too far away. There we go. Get off me. Oh, why am I trying to start with crouching attack? That makes no sense. No, that doesn't work. Crap. I'm so used to starting my combos with crouching attacks, I don't know how to not start with crouching. It's like, that's all I know. It's crouch, hit. Crouch, hit. That's how you work. Okay, let's try one more. See if I can't get a win. Hopefully I don't have to end on a loss. That would be embarrassing. Alright, let's see how this goes. Fuqua. No, oh, Aphilia. Pure Aphilia. Bring it on! Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime! Ah, it didn't work. The physics whiz start doesn't always work. But... When it does, it's... What? Ugh. Why is that heavy punch not coming out? It's a medium punch, heavy punch... Like, jumping medium punch, jumping heavy punch into... Axe kick. That's how it's supposed to work. Although I keep forgetting to do a light kick into axe kick. That, that would help a lot if I remember to do that. Ugh. No, this isn't a... Appear to be a win, but we'll see. What? Ugh, how's that not a jump? Ooh, my arms would still. 
Ah, what? It's supposed to be a jump cancel. I know I did it wrong. It's just it's annoying because I thought I did it right, and then I realized my hand is slightly below where it needs to be. What? Ah. Okay, there we go. Still got to win. It was not the best of wins. I don't know how I, like, I don't know, it's like, I'm thinking I'm jumping, I'm going up, and then it turns out I'm actually going to the side. I think I'm not quite at a 45 degree angle to go for the forward jump. I'm at like a 20 degree angle off the horizontal, it's just, yeah. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. I realized, like I said, just rambling, but that's, that's what it was, so hope that was entertaining enough. Thank you for watching, and have a good night, everyone.